It is officially in full swing in Orlando, one of the largest comic, anime, and sci-fi gaming conventions. And this year, the event features celebrities from some popular films from the 80s and 90s and several from recent movies like Shazam. News 6 at 9's Carolina Cardona is at the Orange County Convention Center. And Carolina, you got an inside look yesterday at some pretty cool stuff out there. That's right, guys. Well, doors just opened, so fans are arriving here looking pretty cool in their costumes. Now, we are live from the captain's chair on board the Enterprise Starship. You may recognize this setup from the popular iconic show, Star Trek. This display is by a production company called Neutral Zone. I'm told that this is used for several fan films that are produced to replicate this iconic scene. Now, instead of having Captain Kirk at the controls, you'll have yours truly here to explore new worlds and find new civilization. So while I'm doing that, you guys can check out what to expect at this year's Megacon. You're going to feel the electricity bursting out of the Orange County Convention Center. Megacon Orlando is back and promises to be better than ever. It's a four-day celebration of pop culture where fans come together for a one-of-a-kind experience, where they'll get to see all sorts of comic, sci-fi, and horror merchandise products, and displays like these lovable R2-D2 robots. He's got a good attitude. He's, he's that kind, caring robot, but he's got a little sass to him. Over at the COS FX Studios booth, I joined in on a family portrait. Not just any family, the Adams family. At this year's Megacon, expect to see some A-list stars from iconic movies and TV shows. We have the cast of The Goonies. We have the cast of Smallville. Among the star-studded list is the cast of Back to the Future, Michael J. Fox and Christopher Lloyd, and Zachary Levi from the movie Shazam. On opening day, fans lined up ready to explore. This is a place where you can truly discover new fandoms, you can celebrate your current fandoms with the community, and you can find a real sense of belonging. And for the first time at Megacon, the Orlando-based nonprofit organization Limbitless Solutions. They'll be showcasing some cool magnetic sleeves. So the child can actually change what arm they're wearing. So if one day they want to be this League of Legends character and the next day they want to go ahead and snap this one on, they can do that. They'll also unveil a new video game that teaches kids how to use their bionic arm and their bionic kid comic book. It deals with being confronted by a bully, how to overcome that, talking about differences, and, and basically embracing who you are. A mega event where everyone is welcomed, including some wildlife. The Dragonwood Wildlife Conservancy nonprofit is on display with small gators, owls, and snakes, like this Australian olive python. So now we are actually in front of the Guess what? Who are you going to look for? Ghostbusters. There you go. It's so a pretty cool later. display. <laughs> so now, uh, uh, event organizers tell me that they do expect over 100,000 fans to fill the convention center. Among the other celebrities is Wonder Woman, Linda Carter. Also, the uh, Mickey Mouse Club 30th anniversary reunion. So lots of stuff going on here at the convention center all throughout Sunday. So, you know, if you guys haven't gotten your tickets or your costume, get those ready and come on down here. All right, Carolina, thank you so much. We love Ghostbusters there in the background. That is so cool. So many good photo ops out there yes. at Megacon. Yes, I know Troy is super excited that Linda Carter oh, is yeah. there. You can hear him cheering in the weather office now, his woo-hoo back there. He won't go, though, because of that snake she was holding at the end. <laughs> well, I mean, they're not going to chase <laughs> him with that. Yeah.